There were no COVID restrictions at the bars and restaurants for St. Patrick's Day celebrations. And people definitely took advantage of that and the good weather. Bar owners say it's just what the industry needed after a difficult last few years. News 8's Byron Tollefson stopped by some Irish bars around Grand Rapids. Yeah, I didn't go out last year because of COVID, so that was been, yeah, kind of a bummer. But this year, we're going out full force instead, kind of good rallying the troops and stuff. It's the first St. Patrick's Day in years without any restrictions for bars and restaurants. Last year, it was still early in the vaccination rollout, and bars were limited to 50% capacity. Combined with cold weather, it was not an ideal time to celebrate. It's disappointing because you have to turn a lot of people away. And, like, you know, you, you have a restaurant, you don't want to do that. So, so this has been great that everybody's been able to get in today. It kind of sucked last year. We, we got here really early, but then, like, half of our friends couldn't get here last year. So it kind of sucked because there was only half of us. And it was, like, three hours to get a table. Totally different. Like you said, half capacity, really bad weather. But this year, with no restrictions, Cheers. Grand Rapids came out strong. We thought people... Like, might come out again, but not like it has been today. This has been great. It is perfect timing for an industry struggling with supply chain issues and rising inflation. It's great. It makes up for, for quite a bit that we lost over the past couple years. And St. Patty's Day brought some luck with the weather. Temperatures were in the high 60s. It's a nice day. Just got back from Minnesota. Just moved back here. It's negative 15 every day, so it's top notch. I actually don't think I went out last year. The past like, couple years have been a little weird, so it's super nice to be out like in this beautiful weather today. It feels like summertime. I love it. A lot of people feeling pretty lucky this St. Patrick's Day. It's just nice to get out and see friends again, because some of these people you, know, you haven't seen for a while. In downtown Grand Rapids, Byron Tollefson, News 8.